like a stand up routine. Remember when we were going to do stand up? Oh, I was telling. I told Mariah about the time that you tried to do a one minute routine for me. I don't know. We just got on the subject. Oh, that's like, hilarious, Parker. Yeah. No, that's so funny. I told her, though, I was like, I, I couldn't it, have done it. But yeah, I know. You did it, and it was the worst thing I've ever heard. It wasn't the worst. It was funny. <laughs> it was so bad. Dude. It was so funny. I don't think I don't really. even remember what it was. I rem- like, you remember all of it? It's so, you are like, funny, Friday, but that right? was the least funny thing that's ever come out of your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot, what did I even say? I you were know. telling a story. I remember that part, <laughs> but there was a lot of like setup and uh, a lot of backtracking. You're like, yeah. you know what? <laughs> so Wait, no. <laughs> Actually, dang, classic Gavin story. Was bad. But then you told me that and they were both tall guys. <laughs> that Hannah, that you did it for Hannah. She did not, and think she it was hated funny. it. <laughs> yeah, she thought it was terrible. <laughs> you did a stand-up routine for Hannah. I, we were driving. I would, <laughs> he was bored. Just sit down. We yeah. were driving, and part you guys had talked about doing uh, like a sixty-second stand-up set. Yeah, and I, if you could, and I was at work or something or doing something. This was back in Oregon. This was a while ago. I know. And so I tried it to... It was so bad. I remember exactly where in the world we were when it happened. <laughs> where were we? Where were you? <laughs> where were we? Where were you during Gavin's stand-up routine? <laughs> we were driving on Beltline, getting off the exit right. to go into Highway 99. <laughs> and we were stopped at a red light by Jerry's turning left. And I like... I'm glad we I were driving, Parker. <laughs> <laughs> I was like... Uh, that pillar is <laughs> no. looking really good right now. No, that that divider. But I, was, I couldn't just like make up a it minute. Was making it up though, right? That's yeah, I true. did. Wasn't it a routine? I think it. Oh, I just made it up. up. Oh, it was improv? Yeah. No, you weren't making it up on the spot though. Well, I like thought of, was thinking about it that day. And oh, I that's just not like, making it up. <laughs> that is pretty he much. He did improv. make it up though. Yeah, he did you make made it, up. it up. It wasn't stolen, but it wasn't. It wasn't like stolen on dollar. the spot. Okay. Yeah. Not about that. There, oh, that we had a startup party yesterday. Mm-hmm. And, Did you see uh, someone's valor? No, one of the guys. Their <laughs> valor is showing. <laughs> one of the guys we were sitting with. Um, <laughs> he <laughs> he was talking about how he, he was older, probably in his uh, 60s, yeah. and was talking about how he really enjoys comedy. His wife was saying, like, oh, he loves to make jokes. Yeah. And, um, it was like he started, started talking about a bunch of comedians, and there's this. It's called a, a dry bar in Utah, so it's oh, dry yeah. bar Where comedy. You, so you can go there, and it's that? clean. It's clean uh, comedians and comedy because there's Where is that like, at, no Utah? drinking in Utah. Is Utah the Mormon like, state? Yeah. yeah, nice. I swear, um, I just heard about that too yesterday. Maybe. I don't think it was yesterday. Oh, really? Yeah, like that's the first weekend. time I've ever heard about it. Yeah, me too. Last night, I don't remember who it was. You know what? Me too. Really? About just now? Was, just now. Oh. But was. Uh, he was just talking about with some comedians, and then I told him about... I didn't tell us. I did not tell him about our podcast. I just told him about... Oh, when you like comedians? <laughs> I did stand up once. Uh, <laughs> you got to hear a stand up routine? <laughs> <laughs> Ask my wife about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I told him about uh, us going to Kansas City and about Jake and Brad and... Our Trey. comedian friends. And he wrote it down. He's like, going to listen to Ghost Runners and stuff. Oh, nice. Check it out. It was like... There were like Jake does stand up and Trey Kennedy. You might have heard of him. He does stand up. He and does videos. stand up and all their skits and pretty hilarious. So uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. That was fun to talk to him about. He's a piano tuner. He doesn't play. He, just he doesn't tunes play. He, he just, just tunes. knows how it's supposed to sound. Yeah, he oh, just tunes. Sick. He like goes around. He said that a lot of his clients are in Tyler. Goes around just tuning tuning pianos for he's people. A, he's got perfect pitch for show. What? Oh yeah, it's very impressive. People that can do that. That's cool. Yeah, that, but there's got to be technology for that. Uh there's an app on my phone that tells me when the guitar is not right. Yeah. Yeah, but I think a little the, bit more complex. Yeah, it's not. It's but not it like can't digital. Be that much more. It's complex. like a grand, like grand pianos and stuff like that. I have no <clears> idea how they work. Hmm. This guy does. Yeah, and he fixes them. That's cool. Mm-hmm. You don't think you could give us 60 seconds right now? Absolutely not. I don't want to try again. That's, no. That if would I be g- too embarrassing. The fact that it's burned into Parker's brain, <laughs> I don't this? want it to be stuck in time on a podcast, yeah. on multiple platforms, and on YouTube. What was the story about? I don't remember. I don't remember what it was. I, I genuinely... You don't remember what the story was so, about so at all? No, I straight up do not remember. Yes, I'm kind of glad, though. 
Yes, you remember. No, I don't. I really don't. I, what would it have been, even been about? I remember thinking it was so good. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is actually pretty funny. I think maybe just how I told it was funny because it was so terrible. No, that's why it was unfunny. It's because I told it. No. <laughs> what was funny? None of it. Uh, <laughs> Oh, you were just saying I'm funny. Yeah, but that was not. Yes, <laughs> You're like, Gavin, you. I didn't listen. Say- I you are funny. That was the worst thing you have ever said. That that was not funny at all. Correct. I was so embarrassed for you as you were telling it. Yeah, fool. I'm a fool. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be a terrible. It would, I would be a fool to try and do some <laughs> sixty stand up improv comedy right now. There it is. Sixty stand up in. <laughs> Prof comedy, right? I said 60 seconds. I know. <laughs> I said 60 seconds. Oh, you didn't. That's I right, did. though. Everyone go back and listen. Everybody go back and listen. I said 60 seconds. All Man. right. Let's hear you do some improv no. comedy. Yeah, right now. <laughs> it's not worth it, like Parker was saying. No, okay. It's not worth it. If I took, if I dedicated a solid, like, couple hours. A couple mm-hmm. hours for 60 seconds? You got to make it good. Yeah, I bet 60 but, seconds is a little... Okay. How much time do you need to write 60 <laughs> seconds? We'll 60 right minutes now. for, 50, for okay. 60 seconds. You get one hour per second? to yeah. write 60 seconds of stand-up. I think that... Oh, that's bring what it you to want? his next episode. That's what you get. Yeah. Bring it to his next episode. That's a week. Yeah. You got a week to do You got a week to hours. do 60, I'm not going to present 60 minutes of stand-up. <laughs> Gavin's asked me to do 60 minutes of stand-up <laughs> live on the podcast and saying I'm not going to do that. If we just if it's that easy, we just do sixty seconds. We take sixty minutes, uh, yeah, of our week every week, so we have an, a full hour. That's what or we do we for this. Thirty three minutes, thirty three. That'd be no. sixty hours of work a week, Gavin. <laughs> yeah, dude, we can do that. Thirty three minutes for what? No, I was doing the math wrong. I you don't think know what I was, I was thinking of. Like a hundred, hundred, hundred minutes. We just take twenty minutes to make twenty seconds. Yeah. Everyone, let's just take one minute to make one second of joke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> just sit here for a minute and think of something. I'll let you know when time's up. Boy, how, how long are we waiting? A minute. That's okay. <laughs> that's th- one second. 60 seconds for one second. 60, 60 minutes <laughs> for one For second. 60 seconds. So then if you want to do... Are you going to be silent for an hour? No, no, no. no, no. He's saying we're silent doing for a minute. one minute of silence for one second of comedy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a minute's a long time. <laughs> wow. We have to restart every time we talk, too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately. Have we started yet? Has it been one minute yet? <laughs> yeah. It has? Okay. <laughs> All right, ready? Go. Yeah. So I was... <laughs> wow. Wow. I could that's... tell you were going somewhere good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Parker. That was mine. That was his. Do it again. <laughs> oh, it was different. <laughs> <laughs> it gets them every time. <laughs> Improv. <laughs> Kevin. So there was this can. Man, I could tell. Yeah, yeah that, that was, was going to be a good somewhere. one. <laughs> <laughs> See, unlike the first time I ever did stand up for Parker, <laughs> that was going somewhere. I laughed I more. I laughed more joke, at that. I don't than think any <laughs> joke has ever started with. So there was this can. <laughs> <laughs> the hand movement. You could was have crazy. started with like, "What's the deal with?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every joke starts like that. <laughs> yeah, I know. not this one. Not that it's different yeah. than all the other jokes. It's groundbreaking. It's dangerous. It's concrete. We should do a, a, an exercise where we do a stand-up routine, but we only say one word at a time, and the others have to pick it up. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ready? <laughs> do you remember those stories that we wrote on the way to Mexico? Yeah. yeah. We would do like each, we each do a <laughs> sentence, and then someone else would do a sentence. Yeah, that was so fun. That was so fun. Was it a sentence or a word? I think it was a word. It was as much as you want. Okay, let's do a word. Okay. okay. Ready? So. There. Was. This. <laughs> crazy. Guy that ran away for fraud. Yeah. Oh. When his mother caught him <laughs> dancing, <laughs> he decided to stop <laughs> playing piano. <laughs> we have to go faster so the listeners can catch up. Yeah, there has he to be a punchline. 
he 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 <laughs> his he, piano. He his. <laughs> oh, they said he. No, he. Oh, he H-E. was grabbing <laughs> his <laughs> piano, and then he. Yeah, you can't go anywhere. You get shot. Yeah, I mean, it's over now. It's over now. What happened to the fraud? I thought we were going to come around to the fraud. <coughs> what? I thought we were going to come back around to piano fraud or something. Oh, shoot. We lost ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the problem. Let's try one more time. Okay. One more. Gavin, you start this one. I have a good feeling about it. Francis. Yeah. Sorry. The great jester <laughs> of <laughs> Dukesdale. <laughs> Ran <laughs> from <laughs> his friends mm. when they shot him in the butt. He cried a lot. A loud? <laughs> a lot. <clears throat> Two words. Is it? Yeah. It's like, it feels like one though. Okay. He cried a lot. So they decided to put his, his or him, his foot (laughs) up (laughs) on a Billboard, <laughs> <laughs> right? That's funny. Right, funny guys. It. His foot's on a billboard, and he got <laughs> shot in the butt. Uh, or what? The he's gesture, got nasty toes. The gesture of Dukesdale. <laughs> his foot's on a billboard. That's why he ran from them because they cut off his feet and put it on a billboard. You. I think we did do that one time though when we were hanging out with a big group of people. Where like everyone, we're gonna do. A you, you're supposed to. Story. You gotta do it really, really fast. Yeah. You gotta do it really, really fast. Mm-hmm. We should see how fast we can do okay, it. Okay, let's do it. Once. Oh, that was that yeah. was what you were <laughs> Nice, dude. See if we can do what it fast. Forward once. Is it only once? My dog went to the park to poop. Yeah, on the. No, it doesn't have to be continual. Like one cent running on a run-on sentence. No, it's it's I, with I know. Else. He, my dog went, My dog went to the park to poop on the. Yeah. Log. <laughs> yeah. Uh, when he decided to go out and <laughs> pee, <laughs> then. <laughs> what? Uh, come on, Gavin. Then you yeah. decided to go out and I pee. Mean, keep up. <laughs> this is like when you're writing an essay and you're just trying to make as many <laughs> words as possible. <laughs> uh, okay, last one. There once okay, was my you. dog and he went to the okay. park to poop on the log. When I sat on the ledge. No. Oh my God. <laughs> When we got to make it interesting, otherwise you're gonna like say something. When I sat on the ledge, <laughs> that's interesting. When of, he said when of, <laughs> start over. What, you guys? What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was the thing, guys. What? Yeah. Uh, guys love football. Yeah. What are we setting up? <laughs> <laughs> A scene or That's something. our whole story. <laughs> <laughs> Are we shocking this dude? What's happening? Guys this, love, is, this is not. Uh, we this used is to practice this improv is, every week. Guys love this football. is different improv, though. No, it's not. It's all the same. No, it's not. Yes, it is. But we're not playing. We're not like playing I characters. Can't we're playing take characters what's of ourselves. Being built in my mind and put it into a picture. I have to take your words and then I got to change my you picture. You just got to be quick. You got to have an empty mind until the word pops up. Okay. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> an empty mind and open this mouth. Very good. Bah. Bah. Just say the first word that comes to mind. Hey, Chandler. <gasps> I. That was really good. Have a story. A, a oh, story. Two. Tell you. Come on. <laughs> <Gavin>. <laughs> 
you keep doing it and then just. Uh, I mean, I can't, I can't help myself. This is insane. <laughs> you had to start off with an empty mind. Gavin, yeah. you start. <laughs> hey, there. Buddy. What are you doing over here? Can I please ask you a question about fraud? <laughs> well, how did, how did, did you say frogs or fraud? Frog. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> how does the frog get its throat? Its mother gave it its throat <laughs> from being a frog mom. <laughs> you see, how am I supposed to build something if I can't say multiple words? You know what? We'll let you say 10 words and we each say one. Yeah. Okay. There you go. I'm not going to. Okay. So there was this crazy lady who walked lots of dogs you, you didn't have dogs, uh, dogs <laughs> together and she ran those dogs super far and close to a cliff <laughs> the funniest part is you counting <laughs> words <laughs> yeah i got to you're still talking like you're doing one word at a time like you're not talking like a normal person <laughs> no. still well, i can't just say and she was walking really close to a cliff you just did it yeah i did that because i knew that's just <laughs> no. i just got it. i knew that. <laughs> you just did it so fast. I can't just say, and she was walking towards the cliff. <laughs> and she was walking towards the cliff really close with the dogs. I just flipped my fingers out. I didn't even count them. <laughs> I know. Yeah, it's not going to translate to audio whatsoever. No, sorry, no, that's yeah, that's why you got to go watch the video. Sorry, no, guys. It. It's so funny, I promise. <sighs> we've been doing video longer than we've been not. Yeah, it's crazy. We've been in Longview longer than we have, uh, haven't have been in, lo- in, in Longview. Long- <laughs> Long view is one word. Come on, you can't do half a <laughs> word and then two words. <laughs> yeah, and then you can't figure it out. <laughs> view. Man, We've been in long view eight months something. Incredible. Eight months something or something. It was weird. It was really weird going back and just like I get what you were saying yeah. when you were just like going to church and all these things that you always did. I'm like, I'm here, but like But I'm not. But my heart is somewhere else. Yeah. It's somewhere else. <laughs> so my, my heart is south. Yes. Yeah. Oh, guys, did you just hear me hit that? Note? <laughs> yeah. Guys, the moment I realized. That <laughs> the I moment I realized, I just hit that note. <laughs> yeah, it was super weird. I had lunch with Trent a few days later, and he was just asking me about it, and I was like, it was just weird. I was like, I felt like I needed to be like doing stuff, but I just wasn't. I had yeah, no I responsibilities. Felt, uh, I needed to be helping with something. Nothing I mean, I just I wanted to be helping, but I was like, you know what? I don't go here anymore. I'm just gonna, just gonna I'm gonna start sabotaging things. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this cord needs to be plugged in. How about I cut it? How about scissors? Yeah, it was good though. Isn't it so weird too that the lights are vertical instead of horizontal like they are here? Did you realize that when you're driving around in Oregon? Where the stoplights? Oh, I missed that. Yeah. Yeah, in Oregon what? they're vertical. Here they're horizontal. Stoplights. No, means. they're not. Yeah, they are. <laughs> oh, the lights themselves. Yes. Not the stop sign. There's a pole in the middle of the road. <laughs> 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 the the red light, it changes from green to red. A pole comes up, so you can't drive through anymore. That would be handy around here. <laughs> yeah, it would. Actually, that's genius. <clears throat> oh, it would cause so many accidents. It was nice having good drivers or decent drivers again. Yeah. Not that Oregon was ever great, but Texas is better than so here. bad. And the roads, so nice. Oh, so well paved. Yeah, say what you will about taxes. But, but dang it. They nice made they get those dang roads it, those paved. roads are nice. It yeah. seems like they're paving roads around here all the time, and though. And they just don't do a good job, do they? No. I think there's something about the climate also. The heat the makes heat it and harder. The dumping rain. Yeah, that doesn't feel right. Wrong finger. <laughs> like, whoa, what's wrong with me? How did it end up over there? I was messing with it on, the, on this thing. I was like spinning around. Oh. And I was like, oh. Yeah, not that I bad. got to drive Grandma and Papa's Corvette. Yeah, all right. Quite a few times. Nice. It was fun. What did you drive to Red for the truck? Yeah, that, was, that was expensive. Yeah, 
the gas. How much did it cost? It was only like a hundred bucks. Oh, that's not terrible. So it wasn't. It really wasn't that bad. Mm. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> nothing. Oh, nothing. It's gonna be a shorter episode today, you guys. Probably. So There's football on. <laughs> football is going on. Seriously, we got stuff to do. It's just business and. In business, and we've stuff. been so busy Gosh, these last we? couple weeks. I haven't been at my house in years. Yeah, I haven't either. It's been a while. Yeah, I just got back. But yeah, peace. <laughs> no, that's not the end <laughs> of the kidding. episode. Just kidding. I'm just kidding, you guys. <laughs> guys, seriously. Joke. He loves to fake peace. <laughs> fake peace, real war. Did you make that up? That was hard right now. Yeah. Hmm. Talk Some, about improv. Something to think about. Give me a couple words that I can put together. That's uh-huh. improv. Yeah. Fake peace, real war. That's improv. Oh. Let's make a t-shirt. Oh, merch. Merch, yeah. yeah. Shutting down the website. Tom- this When this episode's coming out, it's like your last It's coming down chance. on Wednesday. So Tuesday, 9-12, your last day to buy merch uh, for a while probably. Yes. Until we... D- People are like, so we have please. a new release till we have new drop until people yeah. are starving for merch. Sorry, yeah. you can't have it. Buy it. So buy it now. Yeah, buy it now before you can't. Because we really are going to take it down tomorrow. This is the end or, uh, joke on the thirteenth. Yeah. Nine thirteen. The website's coming down. Yeah. <sighs> sorry, we had to do it. You guys, we're so sorry. We just have to though. This is business. It's just business. You get it. We need to build the hype again and then crash it and burn. Yeah. It's like mountaintop, boom, money. Boom. And then as that big rock is rolling down the mountain, people are watching because it uh, just catches their eye. Like, oh, is it going to hit me? coming down. Oh, it's going to hit me. It misses. No, and then the gas boys save them. Back up the yeah. Then we grab it. And we're like, <laughs> we got to push it back What's up. What's that guy's name? I don't know. That pushes the boulder. Hercules. Up the boulder push no, it's like, like graffitis or something. It's like, <laughs> yeah. Er- Eremes. Karopolis. No, it's yep. Eremes. Or E's. Both buddies? <laughs> oh, yeah, the new the Greek god that they rediscovered, Both buddies. Yeah. <laughs> you guys ever heard of Both buddies? <laughs> oh <my gosh. laughs> uh, no, I haven't. It's uh, Siphius. <clears throat> uh, no, Sisyphus. It's Sisyphus. Sisyphus. <laughs> I thought it was Siphius, but... Hmm. But then um, you read it again, and it's... It's S-I-S-Y-P-H-U-S. Yeah, I mean, that sounds uh, right. He was punished in the underworld by the god Zeus. Wow. <laughs> so, <laughs> he's a very matter pressure. of fact. Prayers up for Ziphysius, who rolls him, who forced him to roll a boulder up a hill for eternity. Wow. Your muscles would be so sore. They are. Oh, sore. They'd be so strong. Yeah. And big. Sisyphus. I wonder how you say the name. Texas Beach. The moral of the myth of Sisyphus is that there is no greater meaning in life but what we give it. When we accept that the universe has no inherent meaning or reason, yeah, we can be free of artificial expectations and embrace the absurd. Nihilism. It's nihilism. <laughs> yeah. Guys, embrace like nihilism. Nothing matters. Nothing's life. real. I can. Yeah. doesn't matter what I do. Just do it. This is Whatever. what I just heard. Whatever I want to do. What is that? It's like nihilism. There's like a word for like that philosophy. Of it's like nihilism, but instead of just being like emo and hating the world because of nihilism, you like love it, love it because it's like there's no meaning, let's love it instead Satanism. of there's no meaning, let's die. Satanism, no, that's nihilism. Nihilism is the rejection of all religious and moral principles and the belief that life is meaningless, yeah, but that's rejecting morals. There's like <laughs> one philosophy that's nihilism, then there's like the world is meaningless, so let's like do good or something. There's like positive nihilism and then there's something else. Or there, there's negative nihilism and then... Let's look it up. Nihilism versus absurdism, maybe? That's absurd. No, I have no idea. I don't think anything I've said is true, to be honest. <laughs> Except for nihilism. Nihilism just is Absurdism. Every choice is subjective and indifferent 
to and in the world. Nihilism. Every choice is meaningless and there is absolutely no meaning. Yeah, yeah I don't really know, to be honest. People just have a lot of really poor beliefs. Yeah, your beliefs. Oh, uh, just weird. You know what I, I've been thinking about? Huh? Yeah. Golf. I've yeah. not golfed in a month. I went golfing literally today. I golfed in a tournament. Oh, yeah. How was that? It was good. I didn't. I played all right. Mm-hmm. Who was How the was other dude with you guys? Huh? Who was the dudes with you? Uh, me, my dad, Matt, uh, Anthony, and Scott. Scott. Uh, no, not Scott. Sorry, Josh. Okay. Yeah. From church. Oh. Oh, from golf. I thought it was jo- Josh as in work yeah. Josh. Uh, oh, yeah. No, not work Josh. It is lawyer Josh, but not Louisiana lawyer Josh. Yeah, the other Wait, one. What? The other lawyer not Josh. Yet. Other lawyer Josh. Yeah. Ah. The one that always wears suits to church. Mm-hmm. Nice guy. Really Very nice, nice guy. guy. Good golfer? He, good golfer, yeah. He's in, he's How's the three hybrid? Like athletic. <clears throat> what? How's the three hybrid shooting for you? Oh, really? I only used it once. Oh, really? Yeah, I was, I've was. i been getting my driver real tight lately. Yeah. I haven't really been able to use it a ton. Even on par fives, although I will say we we're in the tournament, we were playing like from pretty like far up. Yeah. Oh, and like so, the women's tees? Yeah, it wasn't the women's. It was the ones behind those, though. White? Oh, and was so it like, like close even par though? fives, I would have like a five iron in. Oh, really? Yeah, or less. Weird. Yeah. Hmm. It was weird. That you know, that is weird. Actually, actually, seems pretty weird. Except for there was like one or two par fives where I did use the three hub. Oh, and it did good. I haven't been golfing since I figured out my driver swing. That one oh, really? time, I haven't even been back to the range. It's been like a there's month. no no really point in going back. No, I now figured you know it out. That did it now that I know I can do it, then yeah. I can do it. What yeah, else you got to go prove? hit? Thank you. So, literally, I bought um, a case of golf balls a while ago. I did too. Callaway Warbirds, they're like, what is that? You never heard of them? No, no. they're kind of like a chrome soft. Oh, really? I don't know. I just made look that it up. up, Parker. Let's call him out on his lies. Callaway Warbird, Callaway, Callaway Warbird. I got a pack from Academy Sports. Nice. 15 golf balls for 20 bucks. That's a wonderful deal. I got a pack of Pro V1s for my birthday. Are they soft? Yeah, I think so. Dude. Designed, they're designed for distance, so I'm guessing they're Listen soft. Listen to how sick this shot was. Huh. It wasn't really a great shot, to be honest. I wasn't super close, but I'm like, um, what was I hitting? 54 degree. Hmm. I was like 100 yards out, maybe. Yeah. Like 100 yards. And we had already had one pretty tight on the green. Because it was a scramble tournament. And I hit one. And I was using the Pro V1s. Really soft Pro V1s. Like they spin a lot. Mm-hmm. Uh, not like really soft. But they weren't like Pro V1Xs. They were just regular Pro V1s. And uh, I hit this ball. And it landed on the green. And spun back like 12 feet. Whoa, like oh, it wow. landed and then ripped back. Like yeah. it, it, it How'd that thing, feel? It's like landed and like, ooh. Uh-huh. I'd never done it before. Yeah. I mean, I'd done it kind of. But never like a rip back. It's always been like one foot. Like, this one, like you could see where the divot was. Mm-hmm. They, like we were watching it because instantly like landed, bounced once, and then like Ooh. shot back. And then we went up there. That's so cool. And it was literally like 12 feet of roll. Oh, that's back. sick. It was crazy. I've seen that in videos. And I'm like, that can't be real. Yeah. Well, it there is. was one where we were golfing when we went that super early morning that Sunday that we had yeah. done. What, why were we golfing on Sunday? Because... Service uh, got yes, yeah, service changed. got delayed because the place we were renting like had like a oh yeah no power gun anywhere. show no had a gun show oh we did have a gun show we did it at the evening, <laughs> um, but there was one that I hit on the last and my dad was like that one like spun back off the green I was like oh I've never done that before but I was using Pro V One so it makes sense yeah Pro V Ones are very especially if you're not using like the Pro V One X if you're like around the greens that's just a regular Pro V One I mean you'll get some real spin on there yeah and it's not like you get a bunch more spin but because of the cover it actually holds on to the green mm-hmm. instead of just kind of bouncing like, instead of like boop. rolling in place boom, boom, boom. incredible it's pretty great i have to pee so bad do you, you really? guys hold down the fort yeah. yeah i tried to hold it sorry i drank like you know what that's <laughs> too far <laughs> <laughs> no Look yeah Parker slides <laughs> i still have those in there I'm gonna sell them, I, I love that video of Kanye and his people in that plane. Yes, dude, ah, where they're singing. Ah, and James Corden ah, just. I would love to be in there. Clapping. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's so funny. Our, uh, choir. 
acapella yeah. kind of. No, acapella is when they make. No, acapella is just like no instruments. instruments. It's just your voices. Oh, I love a choir. A good choir, like a church choir. So good. When they're like really a good. good church choir. Yeah. Not just like, oh, we have a choir. And then like an opera church choir. Oh, those are kind of good too. Yeah. We're talking it's about that the- uh, that plane with Kanye. Yeah. That was so sick. We were listening to that at the start of last episode. Were we really? Yeah. Because you can hear both of us kind of like humming it a little bit. Oh. I was thinking about it. I'd like, I would maybe like to start getting to like go see some plays or something. Oh some good God. ones. What? Or like some good. Uh, well, because we're going to a concert, and I was like, concert. "Oh, maybe the fine art things are are pretty good." I don't know. If so I thought maybe we check them out. But I hate musicals, adult. and I would hate a play. And they're so. all musicals. All I plays know. are musicals, pretty much. I watched La La Land on the fl- flight home. Very good musical. Maybe like a good. Uh, uh, what's if it's just a bunch of instruments playing? Also, the thing is, I concert. feel like. I I know, no but like a symphony, a symphony. I've been to a symphony. Be kind of yeah. Fun. Go into like sometimes uh, they'll like uh, what is it? Composers will have concerts. Yes, like yeah, a yeah, really yeah, famous yeah. composer, like uh, like what's his face? Who's the violinist? No, who's the dude from like Hans Zimmer? Like, oh, Hans yeah, Zimmer yeah. has had like I don't. They're not not called conference or not called concerts, but it's just like he just plays all of his songs in soundtracks and stuff for a group of audience. Huh. Could you imagine going and listening to that, like a live band playing all of his like his like Interstellar soundtrack yeah, or the Oppenheimer cool. soundtrack, something like that? Wow, that'd be sweet. But I feel like plays. Yeah. Imagine like well, I feel like they're good, and they don't get enough credit. Here's why. Yeah. Go to if you're gonna see a play. If I ever watched a play for the first time, I hate them. I haven't liked them when I go to them. Yeah, historically you haven't liked historically, them. Historically I haven't liked them. And it's not, you know, against any of the people that are in them. It's just not really my it's art not your, style. It's not your thing. I think that people need to go to Broadway and watch play or like you watch a real professional the best play. Of the best. Like the best of the best. Cuz imagine if you were just like I hate movies. Imagine if you went to a T-ball but game the only thinking movies... this is the best it can be. Right. You want to go watch the NFL or you want to go watch an, the MLB or, or the MLS. Yeah. Right. Watch the professionals do it. Watch the pros, man. Because normally when you go watch a play, it's like your friend from high school. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And th- like that's fine. But it's like if you're judging plays based off of like a high school performance with like 12 people in it. Yeah. Then it'd be like just like watching a bad movie and being like, you know what? These movies? movie things. I don't understand the deal with movies. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Any good movies coming out? I don't know. I haven't really heard. There's another Joker with Joaquin Phoenix coming out next year. Yeah, Ooh, I'm gonna watch that. I know, no, definitely. You ever seen Jurassic Park? Mm-hmm. Yeah, very good movie. I just All watched them. the first one. Wonderful movie. Again. Oh, again. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, I don't remember watching it ever. Well, I remember. I know I've watched it, but it's been a long time. I didn't really remember the whole how it went. Mm. But it felt so short. But I think it's like 90 minutes. Blockbusters. There used to be some real blockbusters back in the day. It's like, come have fun for 90 minutes Mm -hmm. and then go home. I love long movies. Yeah, me too. I'm a sucker (laughs) for long movies. Yeah, I I don't like short movies. Also, it was 3D. And so... You watched Jurassic Park in 3D? Yeah, I wanted to die. What? How did you... Oh, they did like an anniversary. Yeah, 30th anniversary in the theater. That's fun. Yeah. Wow, Jurassic Park's been around a long time. In IMAX, that would be crazy in IMAX. But how do they how do they three Dify a movie that was not originally shot like for that? Because there's like it's not like a special the, camera that's yeah. used. I know, but like how what's the what's the technology to make it three D? I don't know. Because they just blur certain things to create depth, and how does that work? Um, I'm doing I, don't know, I don't know. But it's cool technology. Yeah, three dimensions. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Hey guys, we're back. Quick intermission. Yeah, oh, what happened there? Yeah, what, what was that? We don't want to. Oh, go. you want to clap? Don't tell don't them. Wanna, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <Are> we st- <laughs> Round, Round of applause for the gas boys. We're back. Nice, dude. Tricked me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, we got to do a golf tournament again? Yeah, we do. Listen, guys, it's going to be a shorter episode this week. Sorry. Yeah. Life. 
life, life happens. happens. We want to watch football. I want to go home to my no, wife. It's not a want thing. We it's just a need. have. I need to watch. We just football. have meetings. We have. We're busy. All the guys are busy. We're really busy these days, you guys. I don't know if you realize. We moved to Texas and planted a church, and we all have jobs, and we all have a ton of things to do. And it starts next week, the church. Two yeah. weeks, actually. Yeah. And jobs. And what do we? Others. And others. So, we have so many others. So just not very much time right now. We should have allocated more time, but we didn't. And Sorry, so it didn't feel like it. Kind of the, yeah. Parker was gone. I mean, you know that. He Parker was, was gone. The thing is, doing we, God knows what. Yeah, what were you Christian doing? Christian was doing God knows what. God does uh, No, that. Yeah, everyone knows what I was doing. What? Working. Working. I text you on your birthday. Uh-huh. Hey, what are you doing today? Working. And I was like, <laughs> I'm not working. Oh, yeah. Tell, tell them what happened what at work, we? though. Like What? The lunch that work. they brought you. You guys, I went to oh. work on my birthday on Wednesday. Yeah. And I walk in there. They got... It's, this is in like the conference room, break room, hybrid. Yeah. On the laid out on the table where we have our morning meeting, we've got pie, we've got crumble cookies, coffee from Starbucks. Yes, we've got steak, shrimp, lobster, ribs, like two different kinds of ribs. This uh, what else? Other stuff. Pork chops. Oh, um, uh, jalapeno poppers, all homemade. Everything's homemade besides the pie and the crumble cookies. Who homemade them? Uh, Everybody. I mean, you don't one know. People, I mean, you don't people. know. Yeah, well, one of them. It was like one couple, like one oh. of the workers there. Yeah, oh. and then someone <laughs> else got. But it was incredible. I mean, it was really just for you. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, everyone had some. You know, yeah, what I'm but saying? it was, was like, like the this event is for Christian's birthday. It was like yeah, celebrate exactly. this nice. man's birthday is today. It's so fun. It was awesome. Crumble cookies are good. They are. They are delicious. They I'm just so know how to perfect them. Hungry right now, dude. Oh, Me too. too. My goodness. You ever had mod pizza? Yeah, oh, it's all right. Yes. I went there. Mad dog. <laughs> yeah, they call it's him Mad Dog. It's Mad Dog. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Why'd you say favorite. Mad Dog? That's my favorite. It was like a name. Uh, Mod Pizza. You don't is the Mad customize? Dog no, dude. Preset. Bro, throw some, throw some Bro, pepperoni sauce. Some chicken. Are so good. Why no, 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 no. What's the Mad Dog have? It's pepperoni sausage, and I don't even know. It's, that's You can get that anywhere. Oh, anywhere. Canadian bacon. Bro, would I get pepperoni chicken and oh. Canadian bacon? Wow. Oh, good for you, Parker. You put Literally. chicken instead of sausage. You Ooh. know, you're it's so higher much than thou. Okay. Higher than thou. Parker yeah, humble yourself. <laughs> I did not say that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He did not All say I said it. is that it's delicious and okay, tasty. Parker, yeah. He didn't say he was higher tired. than thou. I did higher not say it was now. higher Literally. than thou. He yeah, said chop that. him off at his knees. What? And then, see, <laughs> <laughs> and then see how high you are then. Then see how high you get. <laughs> yeah. Literally. So I haven't eaten since I went to a golf tournament at 1130. I went to a golf t- tournament at noon. Yeah. And I ate a meat sandwich before the golf tournament started. And then meat I golfed which? a tournament. And then wow. I came here and I haven't you know what, Christian? eaten since turkey sandwich at noon. I feel your pain, but um, just listen He's about to, to say yourself. something. No, listen to yourself. He's about to say something horrible. Listen to yourself. <laughs> listen. What did you just say? Um, you haven't eaten since noon? There's some people that haven't eaten. I played a golf tournament. There's some, yeah, people, that haven't there's some people that haven't eaten in days. There's also some people that haven't played a golf tournament in days, yeah. Gavin. I played a golf tournament. I don't know if you know how rigorous that is. Wow. We you had a cart. Sorry. Uh, we had a cart, but once the ball is on the green, you got to get out and you got to walk you all walk the way up there. It. You can't even get close and to the And you know what? what? Guess what else happens while you're standing on the green? What? What's above you? Oh, the sun. The sunshine. Sun. It sucking sucks sucking the, the energy right out of you. Sucks the nutrients right from your skin. Yeah. Oh my. And sometimes you. So don't tell you me need, about you chip on oh. the green and then you have to go grab your putter too because you forgot it. Yeah, literally. Oh, so sometimes you gotta, like you make two trips, and sometimes you can't even you don't have time for a water break. Meanwhile, I'm on 400 calories worth of turkey and mayonnaise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> turkey and mayonnaise isn't gonna. Man, when it. you put it like that, it sounds gross. Wow. When you think of just ingredients, it's gross, and then you put them all together. And it's good. Yeah. You want you want a, some bread, some mayonnaise, and some turkey? Ew, gross. No, Why would I cheese. want that? But if you stack it in there? Uh-huh. Okay. Yes, 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 please. please. <laughs> Mm-mm. That sounds so good to I me. Was, I went to a uh, like a 9-11, or it was like a troops. <laughs> like, uh, oh, I thought you were talking about this restaurant you went to. Oh, and no. So I was it wasn't confused. Called- it was the tournament. It was like a it was like a nine eleven kind of golf tournament. Yes, like a memorial thing. Yes, exactly. It, it was for like this program called True North. It's like um, veterans. It's like therapy and counseling for veterans and veterans' family mm-hmm. and stuff. But uh, you know who Chris Kyle is? Yeah, his brother, 
who like runs his foundation thing now. Mm-hmm. Um, he was there, really cool guy. He spoke for it and everything. Oh, he was there. Yeah. Oh, dang. His name is Jeff Kyle, I mm. think. Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. Just like the name, like two, f- first name for a last name. Oh, I know. Jeff Kyle. Jeff Kyle. Jeff Kyle. But uh, yeah, really cool. So that was it. Was actually pretty neat. Didn't really golf very good though. Yeah. We were seven under through seven holes. And you're like, this is looking good. And we ended five under through 18 holes. Wow. We had two eagles in the first three holes. Wow. What? Yeah. That's good. One, it was like a par five and then a really short par four where we drove uh, like right off the green and Anthony holed out really? for eagle. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. It was sick. It was that pretty Then we got like birdie and yeah, it was incredible. That's awesome. And then it really... Then it wasn't awesome. Yeah, it wasn't as awesome after that. Dang it. But driver was dialed. Just dialed. Yeah, I'd like to go golfing again sometime soon. We should go golfing for your birthday soon. Yeah, I know. Well, the Divine Nine isn't open. So... Go somewhere good. Go somewhere else. Where are we going to go? Elsewhere. I don't care. The good one? Tempest. Oh, I really... So, um, some of our friends uh, that are live in Louisiana that... That don't, come to our church. Don't, don't point. Don't point. They live in an Air Force base, and there's a really nice golf course, course really? on their Air Force base. And Josh has never played it, and so I wonder and what I it would wonder. take to be able to go play. Maybe that's where Good Good was coming from. No, they, they were, were it was somewhere yeah. else. So. I bet we could just ask. Yeah, yeah I'll like, ask. Okay. Him. That sounds awesome. That does sound awesome. And only Air Force people can play on it usually. Yeah, you only Air Force people can play on it, or if you're like. Friends, uh, friends with somebody, and they get you on the base. Yes, dude. There you we go. Know friends, we're friends with somebody. Have you been to the house? No, the house is pretty cool. Yeah, like it's all super old. Like it's one of the oldest Air Force bases uh, on the U.S. It's a, like a historical landmark, mm-hmm. but also all the um, houses because they're historical, they can't tear them down. I oh. might have mentioned it one time before when I went to dinner. Perchance, but anyway, um, so they're outfitted for. Uh, they like put new modern technology of just like HVAC and stuff in the houses because they didn't have it back then. They just had all their windows uh, were doors or were basically doors that were floor to ceiling so they could open up to let air flow through the house. Oh. <clears throat> but to hang things on the oh, wall. Oh, they open like, like this. Yeah. That's cool. To hang things on the wall because it's uh, plaster and you can't really nail into it. The uh, trim at the top of the wall is barely a gap from it. Um, in between the ceiling and the trim, and there's uh, these hooks you put on with wire so you can hang things on the wall, like pictures oh, and stuff, wow. but you have to hang them up from the trim. Very, oh. very interesting. That is very interesting. Very yeah. cool house. Very That's very, I've never base. been on a military base before, and I want it to. You didn't go on to, to the, the air show? You didn't no. go to the air show? Yeah, air dude, show. it was so awesome. Oh, yeah. Should have gone. It was cool. It didn't sound very awesome. It was. It, I saw the Blue Angels. What do we? <laughs> they woke me up. I fell asleep in the car. Yeah. Because we were about to leave, and yeah, remember, everybody awesome. wanted to leave, and I said we need to see these. Yes, and we saw and we them. It was cool. We did. It was also Hannah's birthday. So oh yeah, like, did she love it? Oh for yeah, her birthday. It was great. She loved it. Yeah, she wanted to do other things, so we did some other stuff. Um, the next couple of days, but it was like a birthday week. Their what? birthdays are like, Bookers celebrate birthdays like it's a month long for each birthday. Yeah, yeah they love it. It's so funny. What do you think about? Like birthdays, do you think? I feel like girls can care more about their birthdays than guys. Yeah, guys aren't allowed to. I don't think. I think it's weird if a guy. It's not that loves we're not it. allowed to. It's just you don't really you just don't feel the need to. But yeah. when a girl does, it's like that's cool. They love it. Yeah, it's awesome. But if I have like a guy friend who's super super into his birthday, uh-huh. it's like, oh, it's like oh. yeah, that's kind of cringe. Kind of. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, yeah. uh I think it's cool that they're into it, and they're like, "Oh, it's so fun!" They get yeah, and then they do so like fun. nice and then celebrations, the girl, then and she, I always get great desserts. Like, yeah, because they're yeah, celebrating, true. and there's leftovers. Like, who does Hannah care about your birthday a lot? Oh yeah, yeah. See, and then the girl cares about your birthday. Oh yeah, I care about hers, and I like will do stuff for her. Yeah, you care about hers more than yeah. you care about yours. Yeah. Oh, of course. I don't even cool. care. As long as we care. get to like go do something, if we go golfing. Yeah. Great birthday. Great birthday. Incredible, <laughs> Incredible birthday. If I get to sleep in, great birthday. Yeah. But if there's bacon with breakfast, great birthday. Great birthday. Yeah, that's the thing. I used to look so forward to my birthday when I was a young. Yeah. And but that's when you got like a bunch of toys. Yeah, a bunch Dude. of toys. And also, 
toys. Yeah, I think that's why. Birthdays. And then birthday party. Oh, your birthday friends got party, to come over. You got all, all your, your friends. friends got to come over. Yeah, unlimited crazy. amount of time. Not like oh, uh, your friend can come over for two hours and they got to go home. Or uh, all your friends got to come over for a sleepover. Yeah. Oh, so fun. But now I can do all that stuff whenever. That's I want. what I'm saying. I can do everything I want to all the time now. <laughs> There's no nothing really that anyone can give me that you can't have. Any I other really time can't or... have just you know for myself. Yeah. Besides, like an airplane, good stuff from people you love, like me, yeah. like things. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like Actually, this, my parents also got me really good gifts. This gift, yeah. like means I a lot. definitely couldn't afford. It. Like I could afford it, but it's like but it would be, be stretching you thin. It's yeah. gifts that's like, oh, I would never buy this for myself, right? Or, exactly. Or you're that's so thoughtful because I was like, oh, I would never think, but I love this gift. It's amazing. Yeah, those are good too. It's that's like I wouldn't best. even realize that I wanted this, but I, know. I have it. It's like you know me better than yes. I know me, and you got it for me. This just hit me. Uh, what is it? A bus? Please don't tell me. <laughs> it is a bus emotionally. Oh, oh my gosh. So <laughs> I'm married, bus, you know, right? Bus, just plan and it. <laughs> I have my own house now, but Yeah. Um Don't cry. Unless Hannah's out of town, which even if she was, it would be so weird now. You don't get to have sleepovers and hang out with the boys <laughs> all night and play you video games. You only have anymore. sleepovers every night. Yeah, with that's the all boys, you... I said. Oh, Shut yeah. up, Gavin. You'd rather sleep with boys than with your woman? <laughs> no, I'm just saying, like, I'm never going to sleep over at anybody. Yeah, but you gave again. that up for what? Something so much better. <laughs> yeah, but I'm just saying. I was just oh, thinking about Oh, I feel so bad for you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you got an oh no, wait till you. I just guys, got hit by an emotional I just got hit by an emotional bus. Yeah. The emotional bus just hit me. Guess what it was? Guess what it was? No more boys. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Gavin. All right. You know what? Hey, shake my hand. Shake no. Shake, shake my hand. hand. You know, I get it. He gets it. I validate your feelings. It's okay. It's okay to be sad. I don't need your validated feelings. I don't Parker. really validate them as much. No. <laughs> oh, Parker, guess what? <laughs> what? Eat it. <laughs> yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah. You, yeah. Eat it. Eat what? I don't care, but eat it. Dinner. If it's Joke. dinner, I will eat it right now. Yeah, sure. also dinner. You get dinner more now. Yeah, I got dinner a lot before. Yeah, but you, yeah. you get dinner every day. It's better now because, you know, it's made with love. Make, well, yeah, when I make it for myself, I guess I don't make it with love. Yeah. You don't love yourself. <laughs> I don't think, oh, I'm I'm so excited to feed myself. Yeah, you make it with <laughs> hunger and self-indulgence. Yeah. <laughs> Preparing this meat with self indulgence. <laughs> I need I always, food. I, need I saw this thing energy. of like uh, when guys make meals. Yeah, it's always just like meat with no side, and it's it's very true. Yeah, sometimes yeah. I'll just make ground beef and I'll eat it for dinner. <laughs> no, you won't. I swear. Yeah, that's the true. That's the true. Maybe it's just I just don't. Maybe you know, I'm just really unique good? in that way. Ground turkey. Uh, it's not as good to me. I know, but it's so lean. Yeah, but it doesn't. But it's. It's lean, but no one eats plain ground turkey. I can eat plain... <laughs> half, half turkey, half beef. I, I can eat plain, plain ground beef, I bro. Do, bro. I can eat plain <laughs> ground beef. so weird. Because it's beef. Plain ground turkey would bro, be too Bro, throw that on a tortilla with like some guacamole. Cheese. Let me guess. Guac- guacamole and sour cream and cheese. Not cheese. 10,000 calories right there. Guacamole and is like good for you. 40 grams of protein. Yeah. Avocado? I could have 40 grams of protein and, you know... Zero a few calories. hundred calories. Okay, then get turkey. Turkey's got have... way more protein than than beef. No, it doesn't. And it's not as bad for you. Per capita, it does, I guess. Yeah, one hundred percent. Beef does. is not bad for you. Red meat is it's the best thing you could right. possibly yeah. eat. I don't know. I Red don't, meat. I don't is think it's the very best very good for you. It, chicken's better for you. No, it's not. Red meat gives you cholesterol. Yeah. Red. No, that's you have been programmed by the system. <laughs> The system has got a hold of you. I'm in the matrix. I'm You're in the ma- literally. Parker needs to break. This guy loves. Oh, you know who I haven't heard about in a long time? Who? What's his face? Shirt off, raw meat guy. Liver King. Liver King. Liver King. What happened to him? He's still Whoa. chugging. I think. Really? Yeah. I haven't heard of like anything. He got him busted for time. roids. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but I remember he, when we talked about this back a little like, bit, long time ago. There's macronutrients and micronutrients. If you're only looking at the macronutrients, yeah, then you eat chicken and that lean, whatever, what the heck. Throw lean some is good for you. Lean, really? Lean. You, you just want lean? Chicken is lean. <laughs> chicken is not Not lean. everything is lean, Christian. We need to talk yeah, about this. <laughs> Seriously. 
Chicken is all lean, you can guys. think about is cough uh, syrup all the time. No, it's lean. It's all lean. It's, uh, it's everything not. Is... Not everything is lean, Christian. <laughs> I'm saying Jeez. micronutrients. Yeah. Red beef is so good. For, red meat is so good for you. Yeah. I look know. into it, Gavin. Just look it up, man. Dude, I love a good steak. You can, and it's steak, like a real steak. Oh yeah, I know. It's Grass good fed. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Beef. Sometimes real <laughs> beef is the best thing you could eat. Oh, it's really? one of the best. Oh, yeah, a good yeah. steak. It's so good for you. Sometimes I kind of worry, like, when was the last time I had a vegetable? <laughs> you shouldn't be that worried. Vegetables aren't as good for you really? as people but say. But I feel like I, I think fruit, fruit isn't so as good often. for you as No, fruit say. is actually good for you. There's a stigma with fruit. It's like, oh, sugar's in it. Don't eat it. It's bad. Natural sugar. Fruit's good for you. <laughs> fruit is good for you. Red meat is good for you. Take that stigma <laughs> Eat some, you know, honey. Probably it's good for yeah. you. Oh, you know what, honey? I tried. I tried the Okerman's honey. Yeah, dude. Oh, you know bees. what, honey? I tried. <laughs> I did try. Oh, it. legit. Yeah, Oak and honey. Good. It's I've real ne- honey. Never had like honey that I liked before, and I ate it, and I liked it. It's all wow. It's all processed honey that you've had. Yeah, it was really good. Gosh. Uh, Deering Orchards had honey. <laughs> <laughs> Deering Orchards, dude. Bro, what? Are you kidding me right now? I don't know. This is not it. <laughs> Deutering Orchards. <laughs> Sorry. It's, just, it's really genuinely not funny. I don't know why I, I don't know. Deutering Orchards just You think... Th- this is why I cannot believe Parker with my stand-up thing. He's like, <laughs> oh, wow, your stand-up was so bad. Deutering Orchards. <laughs> That's all I had to say, and it triggered him to just die of laughter. I did. Sorry. What else were we talking about? Vegetable. Oh, yeah. Vegetables, not really that good. Yeah, for I don't want to... You can eat them if you want, but... You don't need them really. What about, spinach is really good for this you. This is what here's how you can survive. Right. You want to know how you can survive and flourish? How? Let me tell you how to survive and flourish. Use this as medical advice, guys. <laughs> do not. We do not. Yes. We do not this have medical not. advice. Eat red meat. Eat. You can throw some turkey, whatever. <laughs> eat a lot of red meat. Eat steak, right? Ground beef, grass fed. It's good for you. Eat fruit. Right? Eat a lot of fruit, guys. Seriously. Eat a, lot of fruit. eat a lot of fruit. It's good for you. Eat some honey. Eat raw dairy, you know, Greek yogurt, that kind of thing. Gavin, don't give me... I've Greek heard, yogurt with berries and honey. I've insane. heard some more raw milk propaganda. I've heard that it's Oh, good. raw milk. It's not propaganda. Raw milk is good for you. Really? Yeah, it's good. Huh. Anything, Why wouldn't it anything be good Anything that's for you? not just, you know... It sounds bad. But Why it just comes it? straight from the cow. It's got to be good for you. I know, but... How is it there's bad? Some people, How is it bad for you? Some we know. I'm not going to say it's who. designed it? for you, Parker. Who drinks raw milk? Ask James's wife. Oh, yeah. Why is it like weird to say someone drinks raw milk? No, I'm just saying <laughs> I don't want to out them as like, uh, as like a raw, as raw milkers. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but... Mariah's brother was talking to me about raw milk. Oh, yeah. Was he, was, he loves it. He's pro raw milk. Zach. Anything that's in its just unadulterated, straight from nature form is the best thing that you could have. Anything unadulterated yeah. is. Except great. for marijuana, guys. It's not cool. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. Yeah, it's don't a plant. Do it. It's a plant. It's, it's nature. natural. Yeah. No. Let me go eat some dirt. It comes straight from the earth. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's so good for me. It's unadulterated <laughs> dirt. <laughs> No, grass-fed eggs. Get some eggs. Anything that hasn't been put through the system, you know. Dude, anything that's been processed. through the system is. How can we trust the chickens we have? I now? do not trust the system. Thank you, Parker. dude. <laughs> Parker, I am with you. I do not trust the system either. You guys, what's gonna happen? I don't know. I don't this know. next election. Nothing's. Oh, right. dude, Paris twenty twenty four. That's gonna be pretty good. What does that mean? Olympics. What does that mean? The Olympics. Oh. No, no, it's not. No, it's not. Be. It's going to be terrible. Are we stupid? All I want to watch is the di- the synchronized diving. That's so sick. All the magic's gone, Kev. No. Where'd the magic There's go? There's no more Michael Phelps. My birthday's not even fun anymore. No. I hate my birthday. No more Michael Phelps. People are smoking marijuana. Gavin wants to eat vegetables. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where's this world coming to? I had a really good birthday. To yeah. be honest, it was one of those where it sneaks up on you, and it's like, "Whoa, it's my birthday!" Yeah, I'm not gonna uh, lie; I forgot it was your. I was like, "Wait, yeah. I had, didn't buy him anything as a gift." Yeah, what do I you mean, there's do? something coming soon. Oh, really? I mean, I don't know. Probably, <laughs> Hopefully. Maybe. maybe just a round of golf. Yeah. Easy. <laughs> yeah, don't listen to that. Parker literally yeah. said, 
I said, Parker, what are you going to get dad for Father's Day? I'm going to pay for his round of golf. Guess what happened? Did dad pay, pay for, for his? <laughs> he had his wallet out, and I was like, oh. Parker, he waited, and you did not do anything. You just stood there, and then he paid for it. Whoops. You <laughs> leap in I got Parker around a round of golf for his birthday. Did you? At Tempest, yeah. I paid for your oh, round. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Uh, but yeah, but then I got so much stuff. It was incredible. And, yeah. like, a lot of people are just, like, doing little things. Like, yeah. we had a youth group that night, you know, and people are like, let's make Christian's favorite meal. Yeah. It's it's like, what, oh, what is it? Man, what's it's your chicken. It's chicken and rice. Yeah. I mean, it's hilarious, but it's so delicious. It is good. Bro, and I had the best Hawaiian food of, I've ever had. What? Or the best, where? like, teriyaki chicken. It's called No Hose. Oh, really? Yeah. Parker, you got No Hose? No. <laughs> no, you did. You said you got some. I did. You, you finally got, no got some? Yeah. <laughs> it was really good. It was just really good chicken. Oh, really? wow. And like, yeah. Just it's delicious. Good. It's good. I've had... I've... Uh, <laughs> that sounds awesome, Parker. It was really that good. That sounds really delicious. I've never had no I wish hose. we had some Hawaiian food around here. That's one thing East Texas no, is missing. Where's no Hawaiian needs? bros, dude? Where's Hawaiian no bros, hose? Hawaiian time, anything. What's that one? In, the other one in Eugene? Poo poo pee pee? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. What's it Chee- called? Chee cheese. Chee cheese? Chee cheese. Choo-choo's? I know what you're ta- saying. It's like a weird double. We went with Noah and Isaiah that one yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And was there anyone else there? No, I I was it, it, was it me, you, Noah, and Isaiah golfing yeah. one day? Oh, yeah, like yeah I was show. supposed to go. Fun. But yeah, Hawaiian food, dude. That's like my favorite food of all time. They, they like The chicken, the rice, mac salad, done. It was so good. So, so good, good, bro. I can put away Hawaiian time. My gosh. It's so good. I, I so miss much leftover time. and I never me ate too. it again. I'm so sad. Uh... That we don't have Hawaiian time. I know you don't like leftovers, but what do you feel about leftover meat? I'll eat it. Yeah. Like, I think cold chicken tastes fine. What, bro? I think it's fine. That's the worst thing you could have said. <laughs> of, like, did you hear his chicken talk earlier? He already hates chicken. Have you ever had, like, a chicken salad? I think chicken is a scam. People hype it up too much. It's lean. Eat it. I don't, it's good for you. I tasted you. some chicken the other day, and I was like, cheap. chicken taste is weird. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, the taste of chicken. If you can really taste chicken, then it tastes. Weird. Don't talk about it. But cold chicken is crazy. It's Chicken's fine. like the one thing that you can't have raw. You know. Yeah, salmonella. But so eating that cold just feels insane. Oh yeah. I wouldn't even mind eating like a steak cold. Oh, I love cold steak. Cold chicken. I don't know That's if fine. I would love cold barbecue steak. some chicken and then put it in the fridge and then the next day just eat it. No, yeah, it's like, I don't That's really feel like warming it up. Foul. I'm just gonna eat it. That's. I would not do that. I would. I do it. But I mean, I have flashbacks of doing that. Like at the old okay. house, I would just, I was Can't hungry at lunch. I would just grab chicken out of there <laughs> and just eat it. And I'd be standing in the kitchen hating myself. We are so hungry right now. You know, if we walked yeah, outside, honestly, my mom had, she made food. I know. Hannah made food and I didn't get to eat before I left because I she thought make? we were starting at 5 I'm so hungry. I know. My mouth is just, yeah. Bleh. What did she make? I told you burritos. You told me burritos? Can he come? Uh, over for dinner. What do you mean, come over for dinner? You're going over there for dinner. I mean, uh, at some point, I have to. I Why? guess so. Okay, but why do you have Hannah to go over just there wants for to like talk to you about your trip to Oregon? Yeah. What? She wants to talk about everything. She wants to hear about his trip to Oregon. Hannah wants to know what's going on. You guys have been planning to have dinner together after no. this without me? She just said on no, Sunday. No, 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 no. She said, she said on week. S- Sunday. That's she was like, insane. "You need to come over for dinner this week," and I said, "Okay." Oh, so not tonight? No, no. Oh, I thought you guys just had secret plans after this. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. I, I, Hannah already I made dinner. Do that. And I am having burritos tonight, mm. but I didn't get, didn't get to eat it before I left. No, oh, okay. Because I had to get here at five oh, thirty. Right. Yeah, we um, talked a lot about food this episode. <laughs> no, we're, yeah, I think it is just, we're so hungry, well, dude. We have not. We need to go to um, if we go to Chow, <clears throat> yes. Pop Stroke. We need to redeem your. Bachelor party. Yeah, we do. Let's go one of these weekends soon. That's where our trip can be. Yes, dude. Yes, our trip. Let's go on a trip to Houston. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. And uh, This week? What are you doing this weekend? Friday? Uh, Next weekend. We're, we're going to the uh, fair on Friday. Ain't nobody going to the fair on Ain't nobody going to the fair. Yeah, we are. When no. you go to the fair, you want to go to the Houston. Let's go to the Great County Fair. On but Friday. also, it's River's birthday. Yeah, but oh, next true. week is the first of service. So let's go Saturday. One day, Gavin. I thought was, well, Friday night we can go Friday. Friday night. I never. Maybe got, not that soon. I never got my money back from the hotel. Really? Unfortunately, I also didn't call enough. I did call three times. Still didn't work. Oh well. But let's plan a trip together. Yeah, we will go to Houston. Yeah. 
We'll put his new one. Yeah. It'll be good. It'll be good. It'll good, be good trip. Good trip. Take a trip to Dallas, watch some football sometime. I want to go to a Texans game. I don't want to. I hate the Let's go to a Houston Texans game. They have a game on Sunday. Let's plan a trip. We'll go up, <laughs> go to Pop Smoke, go to Bogota we'll Chow. Yeah. We'll stay the night there. Go, go to, to Pop Texan, Smoke's grave. Go in to New York. Texans and Chargers. <laughs> yeah. Do they play? They play the Chargers? Bro, I, this whole time I was thinking, oh, the, you want to wait till they play Dallas the Chargers? never plays. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Dude, until if right now. the Chargers play either the Cowboys, the Texans, or oh, the, the Texans, or the Saints, Houston. bro. The, Saints. the Texans Imagine are in Houston. The, yeah. I know. What are we? That's what you were saying. I've yes. been to Houston before. It's like three hours away. Imagine if they like play. Four. No, they it's play not. The I drove there in less than three hours. What? Imagine if they play the Saints. Yeah. Yeah. The, even oh, New Orleans trip with dude, the Dude, that would be so I want to go there. Let's go to a game there in New Orleans. It, well, we have to see if there is one. Yeah. I don't want to wait till next year. That's so lame. Imagine when our money is up so game. much. It's not fun to do things like that spontaneously when your money's up so much that it's like money doesn't even matter. I know. It's only fun when poor. you're like struggling. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Right. Thank you, Gavin. What? Why are you showing me this old schedule, bro? Come on. Ain't nobody want to see that. Don't want preseason. We'll do Titans, a- Vikings, Raiders, Cowboys. They play in home. San Diego. They play in San Francisco. They're playing at the Chiefs, bro. Do you remember when I looked yeah, at yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. Who? Chargers are playing at the Chiefs week seven. That's eight hours. That would be electric. I know. It Not just be so because cool, of the Chargers. <laughs> Lame schedule, man. Lame schedule. Nothing around us? Nope. Just playing the Cowboys at home. Wow. Next year. I it was next year. On that note, I'm so hungry. We're going to go eat some food. Eat some dinner. Also, I don't know if this was in our weird, our weird where we had an oh, the merch thing. But yeah, tomorrow this episode day is like last time to buy merch. If you want merch, just go buy it right now. Right now, now. We'll we're going to be couple of days. developing a new, you know, a line. Eventually, we'll drop that. But this current line, as it stands, it's last chance. Ending. Done. Go and get your miraculous Go and get your gas boys, whatever's. 9.13, it's closing. So 9.12. No, let's say 9.14. 9.14, it's closing. So 9.12 or 9.13. We'll post on our Instagram so you know. Go buy it. It's the last chance to buy, for real. We're going to shut not, it down for a little not while. Not a joke, unfortunately. Sorry. Okay. Thanks for listening. Yeah. Hope you liked it. Enjoy some football this week. See Enjoy some y'all. football. It's back. We didn't really talk about football much this time. I know, well, we, which welcome. is good. Every time we talk about it, everyone's like, you guys, stop. Yeah. Stop talking about football. Yeah. So, but we love it. We love it. All right, guys. See you guys. Peace.